Now we feel wedgie coming on. Oh, oh my gosh, we're twins. Look at this. DIY pocket. Well, I can sit. And in today's video, I am going to be spending 24 hours in my rainbow duct tape outfit. So if you guys haven't seen, I filmed a video where I made my outfit with rainbow duct tape. And oh my goodness, it is way uncomfy, but it is super cool. So I gotta show you what my outfit looks like. So this is the completed outfit. Ta-da, ta-da. My arms, can't, my arms can't go any higher than this. And also, I have to hold my bladder the whole time because there's no way I can use the bathroom. So, I created this outfit with the help of my sister and my mom with all these duct tapes right here. So many. And yeah, I thought it'd be fun if I did some fun activities in this outfit for the rest of the day. So I thought, if I'm in a rainbow outfit, I have to do some rainbow things. And I think the first thing we should do is grab a snack. So I think we should, of course, start off with something rainbow that everyone loves. Fruit Loops. So let's go. All right, we got our Fruity Loops. This is a giant box of Fruit Loops. I actually had this this morning, so this is fitting for the outfit. And oh, we've got some bowls. Actually, I want, yeah, let's let's grab it. Oh, I can't reach. Okay, I can't, I literally can't reach. Okay, I'm gonna try to reach the bowl and fill up my cereal. I feel so colorful in this outfit. Like, I feel like I'm not myself. I kind of feel like I'm like in a costume. Like this is supposed to be Halloween, but this is totally not Halloween. This is May, so exactly. All right, oh my gosh, we're twins. Look at this. Okay, I'm gonna pour my cereal, cereal in. I feel like I've eaten only rainbow things today because it's like, Kind of in the middle of the day right now, so I haven't really eaten much besides Fruit Loops. Today's been a very rainbow day. Guys, I literally can't sit down. I can't sit down in this outfit because it's so tight. If I sit down, I won't be able to stand back up. <laughs> I like literally am on the edge of my chair. I'm leaning. But anyways, I thought it'd be perfect to stand or sit, sit stand right over here because we're in front of the rainbow duct tapes. Literally, we bought out all of the duct tapes from the store. We bought so much, like, we had to take two trips. And we have different colors, like, even, like, colors are not really in the rainbow. We have the pink duct tape. We have purple, like, fuchsia. We've got lots of different kinds of duct tape. I'm wearing this one, which is my green duct tape, but this is also green. So maybe I should have gone with this one, because this one's, like, a yellowy green. But I still think it works. So you guys should leave us some comments with suggestions on other things we should do with our duct tape, because... We definitely have a lot. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, this is so perfect. I'm matching our rainbow duct tape slide. This is the perfect picture. Audrey, you should go down the rainbow slide if your rainbow thing. That would be fun, actually. But if I slid down that, I wouldn't be able to stand back up. I'll help you. Do you want to help me build a slide, Jake? We're going to build the stair slide. I haven't slid down a rainbow stair slide yet, so we're going we're gonna to build it. Also, after we do this, I think what we should do is do some DIY crafts and make my outfit a pocket because I've had to hold my phone this whole time. So I think we need to make some modifications to my outfit. But yeah, well, let's set up the rainbow slide make and go down it. Okay, I found some neon socks. So I feel like they match my outfit because they're so bright. These are like the brightest socks I own. They're brighter in person. But um, anyways, we set up the slide. The problem is, I can't get up. We don't have our rope anymore, and it's so slippery, Jacob. How am I gonna do this? Well, I can help you get up if um, I get some weight up here. I'm gonna try to just do it. This is gonna be hard. Why can't you bend your knees? Because, Jake, are you kidding me? Come on, just try harder. Uh, I'm gonna break my outfit. By some miracle, I made it up the stairs. Okay, now it's time to go down. How should I slide down? Uh, I'm gonna stick to it. You're gonna <laughs> I guarantee you. You have to go on your feet. On my feet, standing up? You put that duct tape Here. against that duct tape. You're okay, not going ready? anywhere. Ready? Yeah. Oh, I already feel a wedgie coming on. I'm gonna sit on my booty. Hey, yeah. I can't, I can't sit. I can't roll over. Oh, <laughs> ah, ah, ah. You have to sit up. <laughs> Don't go too fast. <laughs> That's actually really cool. You blend right in. I'm blending it. <laughs> 
I'm trying not to. <laughs> oh, this is so fun, guys. You should try it sometime. That's this funny. is way fun. You're like lined up right, like the yellow, the orange, and the red, and the blue. <laughs> I have that perfect. Oh, uh, it's oh. awesome. I feel like I'm wearing one of those like silicone dresses that I see everywhere. Mm. You should try no. it. Wait, how is it supposed to normally go? You go down, Jake. You normally just like go this. down like a stair slide. The duct tape is kind of sticky. Well, not sticky, but it's like grippy, so you don't really slide fast. Yeah. I so like this, lads, ready? This uh, laying down is like this. <laughs> That's very bumpy. I will try again. It gave me. Come on, you can do it. It's grippy. You it's grippy. It. Oh, it's just a tape roll. Come on, Eileen. <laughs> is your suit starting to come apart? Honey, where is my super suit? <laughs> this would be my superhero suit. <laughs> Tape woman. I wouldn't be able to save the world, but I would look so good in it. I'm using a lot of arm muscles today. This is a workout. Go ahead like, first. Head first? You saw how fast you went down anyway. <laughs> okay, I can't lay down though. <laughs> Breaking any speed record soon. I'm winning! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I'm stuck! I'm stuck! Uh, here, I'll go. I'll go and stuck her. Oh, because you can't stand up, can you? I'm stuck! Oh no, good luck! I'm stuck! <laughs> I'm stuck! Oh, I can't oh. work it down the slide! No, Stop that. I can't! <laughs> oh, okay. That is funny. Oh. Jake is so strong. <laughs> Alright. Also, I reek with duct tape. I know. <laughs> no. yeah. Okay, next up to me. Okay, guys, we've migrated to Jordan's room. I've got some red duct tape and I want to make a pocket so I can put my phone in it. But I'm realizing I left my phone upstairs. Ah! Okay, we're just gonna make the pocket and I just hope that I can make it big enough that my phone will fit in it and not it, it won't be too squishy. So I've got red tape because red is my favorite color and I'm glad it's in the rainbow. It's actually the first one in the rainbow, right? I think what I have to do is I have to fold this tape. So I'm gonna make it this big. Also, there's no tutorial on this. I'm making this up as I go. So I like, literally, I don't know what I'm doing. How do I do this? I can hardly bend over. I'm getting better at bending over though. I feel like an old lady, but like it's becoming less of a struggle. Okay, here's my pocket beginning. That's a giant pocket. I'm gonna have regrets right here. Oh look, it kind of looks good. So now I just have to do this layer by layer and then it will work. I've got the perfect idea. I'm gonna do the same thing all the way up, then I'm gonna duct tape the sides. Guys, I think I did it. Look at it. I mean, it's, oh, yeah. It is a big pocket. Like, it literally takes up my whole side, but it is functional. Like, look at this. We're gonna do the ultimate test with my phone to see if it works. And if it does, this would be amazing. So, here we go. Ready? Oh, if I don't have to carry around my phone, that will be golden. <gasps> I've got a DIY pocket! A DIY pocket. Ooh, ooh. Oh my gosh, I actually kind of like. And then I always know my phone is right by my side because it literally is, it's like on my side. I feel like it could be a little bit thinner, but you know what? I didn't have a mirror to work with. I just eyeballed this whole thing. So, what I thought would be fun is next up, we have to look the rainbow part, you know? So, what I wanna do is do something I've been wanting to do for a while, and that is do rainbow makeup. And I, I don't remember if I've ever done this before, but I feel like now is the perfect excuse to try rainbow makeup. So we'll see if it works. The only downside is I already did my makeup for the day. So I have to redo all of this. Usually my makeup takes me about like 20 minutes to do. This is kind of annoying. But for the video, we'll take off my makeup and then try to do rainbow makeup. All right guys, so ugh, I'm sitting down at my desk. <sighs> 
but you don't know how hard this is. My shirt is like pulling on me. Like it's so tight. I can barely sit, but this is progress because in my last video, I could not sit at all. So we have our kit here. This is my makeup bag that I usually carry around, but in reality, the only stuff I use are actually in this bag. I'm pretty minimalistic when it comes to things I need. And then we've got some palettes. So one of the palettes that I really want to use that I like have hardly used, but I used this in a video a long time ago, is this one. It's called Aurora Lights. And this one has a bunch of like shimmery rainbow makeup, as you can tell. But I don't think it has every color I need. And I don't know how pigmented these colors are gonna be because this is kind of a very cheap palette. So we'll see what that happens. I'm gonna be using a bunch of different palettes. I also have this other one that I've had for like so many years. <laughs> and this has like a rainbow of things too. So we also got lip glosses and blushes. So maybe I'll just experiment with my whole face, do a whole makeup look. Other palettes I use more on a daily basis are this one, which has like some reds in it and oranges, so that will be helpful for the warmer tones. I don't think I'm gonna use this palette. So these three palettes I'm gonna be using. First, we gotta take off the makeup. Okay, I've got my bare face of, bare face. <laughs> no makeup on, except I have my eyebrows still done. I didn't put on any face face makeup today, so I'm just purely working with the eyes. And also I just made the decision that I want to do lips too, but I don't have like rainbow lipsticks. So what I'm gonna have to do is use the same colors with my eyeshadows that I'm using on my eyes for my lips. Cause you can use eyeshadow on your lips. I mean, it's really crusty and matte, but it works for what I want. So we need to start priming. I always prime my eyelashes with this crusty dusty Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion it is the best thing ever. Not sponsored, but like I kind of wish. But yeah, this just helps it like stay on for a long time. Also, I didn't know this was going to turn into a makeup tutorial, but I guess I'll be showing you guys how to do a rainbow makeup look. Okay, prime my eyes. I think what I want to do is put white as the base. Um, I don't think I've ever done that before, but it'd be fun to have like a white base. So I'm going with this white on this palette. And hoping that it works because this is also like a very cheap palette. I don't buy super expensive palettes, so none of mine are, you know, crazy. But yeah, you can hardly tell that this is white. Let me do some experimenting. All right, this is as like white my eyelids are gonna get, so didn't really help. But I tested out the colors of my three palettes on my arm, and I have gotten the rainbow colors. So I had to get the warm tones from this one, and then I got the rest of them from this palette. And then, I mean, I'm gonna try to do something from this because it has like the shimmeries on it. Um, so we gotta start off with red. So I'm going with extra spicy. Wow, okay, so I'm just gonna start right here. Ooh, wow, that was very, very pigmented. I don't know far how like far up I wanna go, and how I'm gonna blend this out, to be honest. <laughs> I look like I have pink eye. Um, this, is, this is gonna be the like wackiest makeup tutorial because I'm like, honestly, I'm just experimenting. I mean, I've always been the kind of person that just kind of sticks to the normal routine. Like I don't really experiment that much. Like once I find a makeup look that I like, I hardly stray from it on a daily basis. But recently, I've kind of been like wanting to um, experiment even more. Wow, we've got the red. <laughs> so, I mean, I kind of want to find something new. I'm kind of bored with what I've been doing, which is basically my orangey yellow look. So maybe we'll do rainbow. Oh no, I'll see. I'm gonna complete the rest of my eyeballs. Guys, I did it! This is the eye look. Ta-da! So, I mean, I'm not done because I'm gonna put on mascara. And my original plan was to put on eyeliner because I always wear eyeliner, 
but I'm afraid to put on eyeliner because towards the end it got a little bit squishy because I didn't space things out like the best. I mean, they're all pretty even, but like I should have made them um, skinnier so there's more purple. So I'm afraid that if I put eyeliner that it'll cover up the purple completely since it's like towards the end. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna put on mascara and then do my lips, but this is my rainbow eyes. Honestly, I'm really proud of it, and I'm actually surprised how um, much you can see the yellow because it is so faint, but yeah. Oh man, this is so good. <laughs> I'm just a walking rainbow. All right, guys, I applied my mascara, and now I think what I'm gonna do for the lips is, I've heard that like a good base, if you're gonna do lips and you want really pigmented, um, you know, lips i've said that so many times anyways if you want pigmented lips and you're using eyeshadow but you don't have like eyeshadow primer or lip liner or whatever for your lips um i've heard that you just use concealer on your lips and then you put your makeup over the concealer and i feel like this is so wrong but i'm gonna i'm gonna try to do it so mm, i hate i hate matte lips and like crusty dusty okay I got a little bit on, so now I'm just gonna rub it around. Also, this concealer is definitely expired, but... Oh! It's totally blending in! I mean, I guess that's what concealer is supposed to do, but like... Yeah, okay! <laughs> We're gonna put the rest of this concealer on, and then I'm gonna... I'm gonna put on my thing, and then I think that will be it for the face. And then I want to do something else, but I'll tell you when I get there. <laughs> <laughs> These are my lips. I don't know how I feel about them, but this is what it looks like. Finished makeup look. Ta-da! I feel like a rainbow queen. Like, look at me. I, <laughs> like, this is so much rainbow. I'm gonna go show my family and see what they think. And then, my next activity is painting my nails rainbow. Because you gotta go all out. And also... Fun fact, I'm a nail biter. A lot of you probably already know that. And the only way I do not bite my nails is if they're painted. And right now they're chipping. So if I don't hurry and paint my nails, I will for sure bite them. So definitely gonna paint our nails and we're gonna paint them rainbow, of course. So let's go do it. All right guys, so I'm upstairs now and it's time to paint my nails. Um, I still feel kind of crazy. I think it's the lips that are like making me feel really weird. Um, but I've got my color nail polish. So I am gonna be painting my nails rainbow. I think I'm gonna start with my pinky finger and do red and then go like this way. So yeah, um, also tips and tricks, just girly things. Usually I put on a base coat and a top coat, but my base coat, like we cannot open at all. It is so hard to open. So we're just gonna be using a top coat and this rapid dry nail polish. Yeah, we're just gonna get started because usually I would put on a base coat, but now that we don't have one, then we're just gonna go in with the color. Oh, these colors, we got these colors when we were really little, so they're kind of sticky and gross now. And, but the, I like them because they're very vibrant and we basically have like all the colors. But yeah, okay, we got one finger done. <sighs> Nine more to go. <laughs> Here we are. Yellow, especially on your toes, just looks like you have pee toes. <laughs> so I'm glad this is not on my toes, but like, yellow is definitely like one of our least favorite colors to apply <laughs> on our nails. Ta-da! So now I'm in the paint, nail polish painting mood. I'm gonna finish applying the rest of my nails and then show you when I'm done. Okay guys, I finished painting my nails. Dirty. It's time to eat food. And this is what my nails look like. Ta-da! All done. I got my outfit, I got my face, I got my nails. I'm feeling pretty. They just ordered pizza. Yeah. So we're gonna eat our pizza. <sighs> We did contact list, so we didn't come in contact. We're still social distancing. Yes, we are. Um, and I was going to rainbow my hair, but I feel like this is probably good. But if you guys want a rainbow hair video, make sure you comment down below. <laughs> if you guys give this video likes and you comment down below that you oh, want wow. it, then I will rainbow tie my hair. That's uh, going to be crazy. But yeah, this is the completed outfit. I don't think I've ever felt more rainbow in my life. I feel like a disco ball, but not. <laughs> They're going to the process of trying to um, get Audrey her. out of her super. I have used the bathroom 
for hours, like all day long. So they're trying to take this off of me. It's so spooky. Oh, it's more breathable. I can sit! I can sit! I can do squats! I'm feeling so much more free. Also subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!